George Borkard, and this is another Higher Things video short. Why Lutherans don't care how much water we use at baptism. That's the subject of today's Higher Things video short. Some churches care whether you dunk or uh, or how much water you use. They they worry about the, 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 the form of the baptism, that it has to be Submer you have to be completely under the water. That you have to be in the water to be baptized. Lutherans have never ever really cared about that. We care about water and God's name. To baptize means to bathe or to sprinkle with water. In fact, Mark says that the Pharisees baptized couches. Couches. Now, are we to believe that they took them down to the river and dunked them in the water? No. Uh, the Ethiopian eunuch sees water and wants to be baptized. Because Lutherans believe that baptism is what God does for us, then all that is a, all, all that makes a baptism is the Lord's name and water. How much water doesn't matter. Just water and God's name. That there be enough water to splash is great. Luther wanted... Uh, uh, like a pool. Um, but then there was the sort of idea that they had to be submerged and Lutherans ran away from it. Lutheran wanted flowing water. Again, the amount of water wasn't an issue. Now, why do Lutherans sprinkle or splash? Well, we do so because someone told us, Baptist, <clears throat> someone told us that we had to sub submerge folks and Lutheran's saying, well, if you say we have to, then we can't uh, do what you say we must do. We in the freedom of the gospel must do the opposite. And that's when Lutherans, that's why Lutherans don't really care about, um, we, we sort of splash. And the idea that we dunk now would cause confusion with, uh, with other churches, Baptists and Evangelicals, who require dunking. So again, there's no command in Scripture how much water must be used. There's no command that we have to mimic what was done in the New Testament or that a certain means was done in the New Testament. And to baptize means simply to sprinkle or to bathe. And so Lutherans simply have rejoiced that baptism is water and God's name, not how things must be done. When you have to do something a certain way for it to work, um, then you sort of communicate that this is, um, and there, there isn't a biblical word on it, that this is all about you and what you're doing, which is really what is going on with other churches, Baptists and Evangelicals, who, who say that a baptism is their commitment to God, what they do for God, their recommitment. The Lutherans say the baptism is what God does for us. And so all that's necessary is water and God's name. Now, these other churches, I'm not saying they're not Christian. Some of my best friends are Baptists or Evangelicals. But what we are saying is that, is that baptism saves. It's God's work. And it's not dependent upon how much water or how old the person is or how smart the person is. It depends on God's name in the water. And faith, faith, which is born of the gift, trusts that word of God located in the water. Not how much water, but in the water. I'm Pastor George Barkhart, and this has been another Higher Things video short.